people something else. I mean, depending on where you met him, people think that that signifies whether or not if they done met a good man or not. Girl, I done met him in church. Uh-huh. We really need to talk about this now. Just because you met somebody in the church does not mean he is saved. That don't mean he's holier than thou. It does not mean he's any more saved, in my opinion, than the person that you possibly could have met at the lounge, so to speak. Um, sometimes people are attracted to a church to put on a front for what their ulterior motives are. You really have to watch people regardless. Sometimes people can be drawn to a church because they know that it might be filled with single women, women, period, or depending on what they are into. Sometimes people are into the church just as a cover up. Like I said, sometimes people have ulterior motives and not everybody has been delivered, delivered because you, you go into the church sometimes as a broken person who needs healing, who needs this, that, the third cast out of them that you haven't yet been redeemed by the, of the lamb. Okay. Not everybody is on the up and up. Sometimes people are still a work in progress. Sometimes you're getting yourself in more debt situations. Sometimes you are doing things against the Ten Commandments, but you think because you done found them in the church. But it goes back to try to spirit by the spirit. It goes back to take your time and get to know that person. Don't put the title of church on it to think. Sometimes you can meet some of the biggest kind men, people in the church. Sometimes you can meet some of the biggest liars in church. Sometimes you can meet ones that come off like <laughs> little sheep, just little innocent sheep. And all the time, they are little wolves. Sometimes people want to come through the church just like a little a whirlwind to tear up the church. They possibly could be in the process of starting up their own church and causing problems. Maybe they want to date you. They might be married. They might want to date her too. Still why marry? They might set their affections on a situation just to intentionally tear up a marriage. Again, you have to get to know people. It's not an overnight thing of just because somebody says they're in church. When a person gets to quote in scriptures too fast and they are just overly, overly done over when it comes to the Bible and thou say it and the word says and what they believe and everything just is precept upon precept. And they acting like they just so perfect. Them are the ones that I watch a lot of times because they are esteeming themselves a little bit more highly than what they should. What happened to just getting back to basics? Let's just have an everyday conversation. And yes, if if you are in church, I think, yes, the Lord should be brought up. I, I do. But some people, what I call, they get them holy spirits in them. They get them obsessive spirits in them and it gets really aggressive like they going in so hard but they covering up something something is going on on the inside that is working and then I'm paying attention like you got to pay attention to people's minds conversations because now just now just in general meeting people in church just in general meeting people in church i'm still watching them just just in passing don't nobody need to be what what couple what what family is coming for what how did it get who 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 authorized this because i gotta get a good feeling i got i gotta pray about this at the same time 
I'm taking my time, but again, somebody that's too quick. What's the game plan here? And that that's what people, honestly, in general, I've met some people and it's like, girl, wait a minute. I just met you. Why are we just overly acting like you know me? Like, Carol, okay, so what you wearing? Okay, so what you wearing next Sunday? Okay, or what you wearing on? Okay, the gathering at... Let's just say, nobody likes me and I don't... Just weird, weirded out conversations sometimes. But I'm just saying, the people in the church, sometimes them is the main ones you have to watch. Now, of course, it is some good, real, authentic people within the church, but that takes time. That takes time. You got to find out who's who.